Okay, so I meant to show my washer routine, but I made so many mistakes that it was not worth it. And then I'm also in like my dorm, and so I can't even film my hair getting washed. And yeah, and then I tried, I did my sister's hair, I took down her braids, and I put aloe vera, and that's what I'll include in like the aloe vera. And yeah, and like I tried to film her hair being washed but i also failed at that because no one else was like i have my phone and no one else could like help me hold it and angle it and so it just looked weird and i did do my twists i did my hair which i'll probably show a video in there yeah so here i have the drained aloe vera and i'm just taking some part and i'm putting it in the ends in the knots here so that's what i meant to do with my hair but i kind of failed but this is like the key in retaining hair, taking your hair out very well and very carefully when, when it comes out of braids. So with the aloe vera in, it helps me easily take apart her hair from the matting. And it's just, it's so key in retaining the hair growth that she had. Here's the main going here. So here I'm easily taking just with my finger, detangling the matting, taking it apart very slowly, and the aloe vera really helped. Okay, so here are my oils. Avocado oil, olive oil, pasture oil, coconut oil, all of them. And we're gonna put it in the <laughs> okay, So here, the first thing is, uh, this is just from Dollar Tree, but even a really quality can leave in condition will be nice. And just a little bit of water to, liquefy it a little bit and I just put it in my hair, I put it in lines and I massage my hair and like I said 5,000 times, three times a week with this and then the next week I have, oh my goodness it won't close and these spray bottles are just from Dollar Tree, I just have water, I spray my hair, massage my scalp three times a week and Vaughn, this is my favorite one because it's oil and oil is like important. All of them are important, but I really am just vibing with oil this year. Oh, chicken, I'm spilling oil now. There we go. Okay. These bottles we got from, we did tie dye this year, this summer, and we had some other for bottles. But like, I just put oil in my scalp, massage it, and my oil mix was castor. I didn't find good castor at Walmart. I was so disappointed. I was hoping to find really strong castor. Like, you want to find the oil that is just like raw, raw with that oil, not like extra materials. Like, this one right here, it's coconut oil but the ingredients are under is just coconut oil and then it says store in cool dark place so it's just it's literally this the raw 100 percent pure refined coconut oil that's the kind of oil that you want and we had coconut oil avocado oil i didn't find argan oil the one that i want castor oil and olive oil are oils in here in a bottle and again just like everything else three times a week or however many times you want to put it in your hair you go ahead if you want to put it every single night with my twist i think instead of putting it at nighttime i'm gonna put it when i wake up that way it wakes up my hair and yeah and my hair like i'm walking around with shiny hair you know or i can do both i can do like at night time and at morning time whichever whatever but these are like we did so much. I had, I have like, I made like 10 of these, I think. I made enough for everyone in my family to have their own instead of sharing. And then there's these, and whenever they're out, then they can refill. But yeah. And one big thing is like, her hair is of course going to shed because it's just like hair that it's will easily just come off. But I think what the aloe vera does and finger detangling does is like it eliminates the hair that should be coming off. And there's a video that explains the difference between shedding and hair that's breakage. 
and I'm hoping that like the hair that is coming off is shedding hair that's just like hair naturally just sheds so I'm hoping that's what that is